Well, one of the things that I like to do is sit out by the fire. I've always enjoyed just being outside in, the nat in nature and looking up at the heavens and enjoying a, a campfire. And I wanted to share with you uh, from the letter 1 Timothy uh, tonight, uh, starting in verse 12 and reading through uh, verse 17. Uh, Paul says, I thank Christ Jesus our Lord who has given me strength that he considered me trustworthy, appointing me to his service, even though I was once a blasphemer and a persecutor and a violent man. I was shown mercy because I acted in ignorance and unbelief. And the grace of our Lord was poured out. There it is again. I talked about being poured out last Sunday. The grace of our Lord was just poured out, the poured out life, poured out on me abundantly along with the faith and love that are in Christ Jesus. And here is a trustworthy saying that deserves full acceptance. Christ Jesus came into the world to save sinners of whom I am the worst. But for that very reason, I was shown mercy so that in me, the worst of sinners, Paul says, Christ Jesus might display his immense patience as an example for those who would believe in him and receive eternal life now to the king eternal immortal invincible the only god the honor and glory forever and ever amen and i just think it's amazing i, I remember um and i her her name slips my mind at the moment but i remember a lady of our church who would always say that that she was a sinner uh, saved by grace. You know, she never forgot that she was a sinner and that she was saved by God's amazing grace. And uh, I know we're children of God when we place our lives in, in, in the hands of Jesus. But I, I think it helps us, you know, just like Paul wrote, to, to never forget that we're all sinners saved by his grace and his mercy and uh, I just think that's a great way to go into uh, this day Saturday well tomorrow will be Saturday and then and then going into Sunday the first day of the week when we just come and bring honor and glory to God our Father Jesus our Savior and the Holy Spirit who lives within us so I hope you enjoyed this time there it is. By the, by the campfire. And just, hey, thanks for hanging out with me tonight. And I pray you have a, a great a day and uh, that we can see each other again uh, via video uh, on Sunday morning and just worship God together. God bless you. Thanks for joining me. I love you. I'm praying for you. And uh, let's always remember God's amazing grace. God bless you.